Hi everyone! This is day 9, if I'm not mistaken, of my government quarantine here at the Luneta Field Hospital. Um, I want to shake things up a bit. Sorry, I'm still catching my breath, obviously. I had a good exercise um, prior to making this video. So, you know, I have a lot of happy hormones, you know, the dopamine's running in my, my body. So I'm pretty stoked um, doing this vlog for today. Um, I'll do something that's a little bit different. Um, I've been getting a few questions um, from my friends and from my relatives. I actually have three questions that I would like to answer as part of this vlog for today. So the first question is, where do you eat? That's a very good question. Where do I eat? I eat on, I eat on my bed because there's really no pantry here and you guys all know that our life in the current in, in this isolation facility is just you know confined in our hospital bed so where do we eat there i'm so sorry such a messy messy bed i promise i'll tidy it up later after i've taken my shower but this pretty much is my favorite this is a table that you can actually take out so what you need to do is you just need to put this in between um, the bed bars um, and this is this serves as our table so obviously it's removable so I put this here if I'm working on my journal or if I'm having my meals so that's it it's pretty sturdy actually and where do I store it after I leave it, leave it here in between my hospital bed and the cabinet that they've provided where I actually have a lot of my stuff. So there, it's relatively messy, but don't worry, I'll clean it. So that's the first question, where do I eat? I eat in the bed because we have a bedside table that's removable. It's actually pretty cool. I wanna take it home with me. Okay, second question. Where do I hang my, my towels or some of my clothes? Well, I have my luggage to put my clothes in um, as for my towel, um, for those who've been hospitalized, for sure you guys are aware of what an IV pole looks like. So yes, I have converted my IV pole into my makeshift hanger. So yes, so this is my towel. This is my face towel. Again, it's all over the place guys, so don't judge me. This is the IV pole. So this is pretty much what it looks like. It's relatively short, so I just so after I take a shower, what I do is I hang my towel here, let it dry. So I need to make sure that prior to me taking another bath, my towel's dry already. So um, unfortunately, I can't take two baths in a day because by then my towel will still be wet. So I'm confined to just taking a bath once a day. So what I do is at night I just wipe myself. That's where the face towel would come in handy so there so that's question number two where do i hang my clothes last question um i think in the first video that i made i was a little bit worried that i wasn't seeing a lot of electrical outlets where i can charge my gadgets actually this is pretty awesome there are four outlets per bed and then I have a I have an extension cord to make it easier for me to charge my stuff. So for you guys to see it, I don't know. Um, sorry. Let me know if you guys can. I hope you guys can see that. There are four outlets on the wall, and you have four outlets per bed. So that's where I charge my. Um, that's where I charge my extension cord so I can charge my gadget. So where's my extension cord? It's somewhere in the bed, in my messy, messy bed. So there, ta-da! That's my extension cord where I charge my phone as well as my watch. So there, um, I've answered three questions already. Where do I eat? Where do I hang my clothes? And if there are outlets, and if there are, where are these outlets located? If you have any more questions, about my life in the isolation facility please text me or call me let me know i'll try to cover that in tomorrow's vlog so again please continue to pray for my speedy recovery i'm keeping my fingers crossed that i'd be able to go home on the 11th 
that should be my 15th day so I should be ready to go home and go back to work because I won't be contagious um, by then uh, take do take care stay safe happy Sunday again we're still on um, on ECQ this is our day three on ECQ so please stay home be extra extra careful and I'm really excited to see all of you again very soon bye everyone enjoy your weekend